if you want to show images or videos on a full screen and on any screen size we can use light box for that let's add a light light box to our canvas if we head over to this add button and even if we scroll down and in the advanced section you will find light box if i drag and drop this inside my container here you can see i have my container here if i drop this here and if i just keep this one also or maybe i remove this one for now so this is the light box link so with link that means this is clickable if we open the light box and then we see it's it contains an image inside it let's first select an image for this light box we go to the settings tab and if i choose you see i have some images in my tabs for example if i use first this image this image is very big so i can restrict the width and height for this image maybe 300 pixels okay and 400 height so this is how the image looks now now if you click back on the light box settings and if you head over to the settings tab here in the media section in the light box settings this is where you can define whether when someone clicks on this light box whether you want to show an image or a video let's start with an image and let's select one image here if we choose an image let's choose the same image and now let's see the preview how this is going to work when we click on the preview toggle and when we click on this image you can see we can see this image in a full size now with light boxes you can select a different image for the full screen size for example if i come back to my canvas and if i click on this light box and if i go to the settings tab if i click on this image and then replace it i can replace with it with a different image so if i preview this and if i click on this you can see the full screen image is a different image now let's learn now let's learn if we want to have multiple light boxes for example if i click on this light box and if i hit command c or control c to copy this element i can copy and paste this light box multiple times maybe two times more okay and now first select different images for all of these light boxes i click on this first let's change the image for the first one the first one is okay the second light box image is this one and the third light box image should be or could be this one okay now let's also change their pop-up or the full screen image version now if i click on this light box if i had to over to the setting then then replace this image with the same image that it contains on the main screen now if i click on this one if i head over to the settings and if i click replace and then same image same as goes for the last image that we have click and then replace this image here now if i play this toggle button if i click on this one you can see it's on the full screen the second image and the third image now you can see there is one small issue if i want to see these images all of them in a full screen i have to click them one by one so in light boxes there is a way to link all of these light boxes in a carousel or a slider manner let me show you the demo for example if i want to combine all of these light boxes into a one group if i click on any of the light box here and if i head over to the settings tab on the right and if i scroll down you can see there is a group name area i can give it a group name called my images group now with this group name i can combine all of the light boxes one thing i can copy this group name for all the light boxes that we have remember that all light boxes that we want to combine should have a same group name okay 
and then on the on the second side you have to click this checkbox where it says link with other light boxes all of these light boxes can be linked only by this button or this checkbox if i disable this checkbox here it's not going to link with other groups now let's preview and see how our group is working if i click on this light box you can see all of the images are here and if i and you can also see the arrow on the right side or the left side and i can also click all of these images from this bottom area to move to now one thing you can see that here there is no caption or written thing down or on the screen that we can also do with light boxes that we can give captions to images for example if i click head over to any light box here and then if i go to the media and then click on this images here down you will find uh, a caption area i can just write this is nice image okay i can give it a caption and i will just save it and if i just play the toggle button if i click on this you can see there is a caption on uh, down here saying this is nice image same way i can give caption to all of the images in the group one thing remember that i told you that you cannot group the light boxes all together without clicking that toggle button maybe if i want to remove one of these images from the group for example this last image what i can do i can click on this light box head over to the settings tab and i just have to toggle this check box link with other check boxes if i disable this button and if i uh click on the toggle button then if i click on the first image you can see we only have two images here because the last image is not a part of the group now so this is how we can use light boxes you can also replace light boxes full screen version with the video also so if you guys are liking my videos please subscribe like and share these videos that's it for this video see you in the next video